so one is first one is the variable hoisting okay so that is nothing but a javascript hoisting also we can say javascript hoisting is a somewhat a big concept only but i will tell you about the variable hoisting so where javascript hoisting hoisting means it refers to the process where the interpreter or the compiler whatever it may be you may be calling it's a you can call it as javascript engine javascript compiler or a javascript interpreter basically javascript is an interpreter only i can say that, that thing so hoisting refers to the process where the interpreter appears to move the declaration of functions variables or classes to the top of their scope so now for example let's say that i will normally i will give that where x is equal to 5 okay so now i will try to do console.log x so this is the output i want to check if i try to see the output i am able to get the output of 5 now I, what i will try to do here i will give x is equal to 5 i am not declaring with a where now if i try to see here now then also i am able to get an 5 now here at the bottom i will try to write where x here okay so i am i am initializing the value i am not declaring the variable I am initializing the value to a variable and I am consoling the va variable and afterwards I am declaring this one. So that means I am doing reverse. Now if I try to see the output then also I am able to get the output 5. So this is called as a variable hoisting. So hoisting allows functions to be safely used in the code before they are declared. Variables and class declarations are also hoisted. So these are variables, class declarations, we will try to see all those things. So these are functions, variables, classes, these are all in the JavaScript are hoisted. Okay. So that means they can be referenced before they are declared. So if you can use it and you can initialize the value, you can do whatever you want before the declaration also you can do it. Okay. So but they will this will lead to the unexpected errors. These are generally not recommended. So that is a, this is one of the thing which, which, which I can tell you. So for example, let's say that this is the main example okay in functions also we will try to learn about the functions next after this one so now <coughs> you need to understand that javascript only hoists the declarations not the initializations okay so this can only hoist the declarations not the initialization for example let's say that i want to use console.log x here before initialization before declaration i want to use the console.log x here now what did what i will be getting the output here undefined why because we are consoling the value and afterwards we are doing this one x is equal to 5 and here doing the var x so now x can x this javascript cannot move this one x is equal to 5 to the top normally what it will happen is the javascript while executing okay while executing it will move all the variable declarations for example i have not declared it here i will try to see the output now what it is telling here console.log x is undefined so for example if i try to keep it at the bottom so now we are able to get 5 right so when a variable is declared like this so automatically javascript will initialize the values all the values at the top so this is called as an hoisting hoisting means hoisting at the top variables all the declaring all the variables at the top before execution it will try to initialize all the variables at the top so now when you are trying to access this one okay when you are trying to access this one so without declaration so this will lead to an error okay error x is not defined so here at the bottom whenever you are having this one okay or otherwise whenever you declare this way uh, initialize this variable it has seen that javascript has seen that okay x is defined so fine let let me initialize at the top okay let me declare at the top so here initialize it to value 5 let me declare at the top it will try to do it like this so like this it will happen okay you need to understand so this one now if i try to see i may be i'm able to get the output why because we have manually declared here but if i don't declare it it will it will throw an error why because before initialization or declaration only you are trying to access the variable this leads to an error but if i try to do the console.lex at the bottom now javascript execution goes from the top to bottom and here it will see that xs has been initialized automatically at the top it will declare it so this is called as a variable hoisting so not only like this for example let's say that i want to use mm, get text like this okay so this is the function now at the bottom somewhere i am i am declaring this one function of get text okay return or otherwise console.log i so this one will works so at the bottom function we have declared a function and at the top before initialization of this function only we are calling this get text 
then also it will work without any problem so this is this one is nothing but here it has seen the function declaration and it will move this one all to the top so that everyone can able to access it so this is called as a function hoisting variable hoisting whatever it may be so these are all called as a hoisting so this will try to move at the top only the declarations not the initialization so that is one thing so this is called as a variable hoisting okay so this is one of the main concept so this is one of the main concept in the uh, what i can say variable hoisting is one of the main concept in this one so let's move on to the another topic that is nothing but javascript functions okay so this is also one of the important concept javascript functions